Elsa Vanock is upset. He has worked and spent thousands of dollars to keep the company's work truck durable. He shared surveillance video with us today of the truck leaving from this parking lot. Police tell us the truck left here and took Highway 31 towards Birmingham. Joseph Bonnock couldn't believe his eyes when he saw video of somebody driving away with his red 2000 F-350 duty work truck. That was my baby. I love that truck. The co-owner of Superior Concrete says he and his crew were staying at the Days Inn Hotel for 10 days while helping build the new Fultondale High School. They were ready to head back home to Tennessee around 3 a.m., but couldn't find the truck. It's a horrible feeling because... You know, especially you're, you're self-employed, so that's a big loss for, for somebody like me. I'm a small guy, but but it's just to see my guys just standing out there with, you know, with their hearts dropped. Fultondale police confirmed the theft, saying it happened around 1 a.m. The driver, police say, took Highway 31, heading towards Birmingham. Bonnock thinks the suspect or suspects were professionals. There was no broken glass or anything like that. My alarm was set and none of it went off. Bonnock says it's hard to find a 22 year old truck like this right now. I have religiously put in about 10 grand in that truck to get it running properly and it is running so well right now. And I can tell you, I just, I can't believe it. They took it. All that money spent is why he wants it back and has this message for the thief. Just get a job. Everybody's hiring and they are paying great money. You don't have to do this. Well, Fultondale police tell me right now they don't have any suspects. I did ask them, have they seen any uh, recent car thefts in the area throughout the city? They tell me no. The truck they're looking for does have Tennessee tags, so they're asking anyone if they know any information or saw anything that morning to please call their office. Live in Fultondale, I'm Magdala Lusant, WV1013.